Sometimes clothes need to come with instructions. Hey YouTube, it is me, Shane of AthicosCloset.com, and welcome back to my channel. As always, love having you guys here. Now we are just rolling along with all of these try-on hauls. You guys, my guys, my guys, this is a good one. And I am teaming up with <laughs> my favorite Shein for today. And this is a bomb ass haul, y'all. So I'm gonna try to get through this intro as quick as I possibly can. Yes, we are teaming up with Shein again for this video. I love my Shein team. They're awesome. They do not steer me wrong. So before I show you guys what I have, if you're new to my channel, this is the first time you're ever seeing this lovely face. Hi, welcome. I am Shayna of AthicosCloset.com. And I do a little bit of everything here on this channel. So I feel as though you should go ahead and hit that red button down below subscribe to my channel because i'm awesome my subscribers are hella hella awesome it's just come on in and join our little awesome family we got going on over here but if you were oldie but a goodie uh -huh. You know, I have nothing but love for you. So please, everybody go ahead and hit the bell notification down below to make sure that you do not miss a upload whenever I upload here on this channel. Without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and try on some clothes from Shein. Before we hop into the clothes that I have, I did get two bags in for this video and I always love Shein accessories. Their purses, I mean, oh, they always have the cutest things. So I got two of them and the first one looks like this. She is so cute. I love little block bags like this. Like, oh, talk about soups on trend. <laughs> so you have a nice like sturdy handle here. You see the kind of the gold detailing there. You have the lock here in the front that you just have to kind of, you flip around and then you can open like so. It comes with a a chain strap if you want to if you want to you know use as a shoulder bag and then this is the inside not a lot happening here this is really just like a super cute bag this is great for like a little evening out we just want to probably throw your phone maybe a lip gloss um your bank card or something that's just simple that can go in and you're out the door but it's very very cute and then you can you know just if you want to hold it you know and be really adorable with it you can you can do that as well where you can just kind of be like you know boop, you know it's like here or you can do it as a shoulder strap, but I love this. I love the wicker basket thing going on here. So it's a very, very adorable bag. The second bag is literally something that I will probably wear into the ground during the summertime. I love big bags. I am a commuter, so I always, my whole life is always in a bag. So having a cute bag kind of works. And so I had to get this little number here. I love this little pom-poms is what like really stole my heart. So you have the pom-poms kind of along here and then it's not a lot of structure to it, which I like, which means you can kind of really fill it up if you need to. So it does have one basic zipper here. And this is the inside of it. Now it just has one um, pocket that's perfect for like your cell phone or maybe like you want to just throw your cards in here, but she's pretty deep. You know, you could probably fit a lot of things in here, which I like. And then, you know, it's really, it's lined. So nothing's going to fall through the little, the basket area here. Nice big strap. So it fits, you know, the shoulder like so, which again, I need. But overall, this is such a very cute bag, very simple. But you know, you could probably take this to the beach. You could put your towel in here, put your sunscreen in here, your black girl sunscreen, and off you go. So it is literally super cute and perfect. Before I hop into this video, I'm gonna talk a little bit about a little bit about sizing. Um, I may or may not mention sizing in this video as I go along just because it gets repetitive. But for those of you who do not know or who are confused or don't pay attention in all of my other videos, I wear a 3X in Shein sizing. Typically in your regular US clothing brands like Lane Bryant, Ashley Stewart, I wear a 2X, which is usually like an 1820. But for Shein, I size up to a 3X, which in their sizing is an 18. So if I do not mention sizing, for whatever reason, it's going to be a 3X. I If I do happen to mention sizing, it's because it's probably a, a different size than what I'm used to getting from Shein, okay? So I'm wearing a 3X in Shein. Okay, let's move on, shall we? All right, so the first two pieces I have here are my, they're not my least favorite, they're still cute pieces, they just don't fit as I would have liked them to fit. 
The first one is a jumpsuit and uh, I was so bummed that this didn't fit, I'll be honest, because y'all know I love me a fun looking jumpsuit. Y'all know I love print. And this is kind of like all of that encompassed in one. Now I got this one in a 4X and you guys know why? Because I always size up in jumpsuits. It doesn't really matter what it is. I always accommodate for my torso and my stomach area because that's where I carry most of my weight. And you never really know with jumpsuits. It could be real funny sometimes. They be working, sometimes they don't be working. So this is what it looks like. The print is super duper fun. I love the color palette. You have like this gray and then the orange. It's very, very pretty. It is spaghetti strap. So you have these little tiny straps here that are adjustable. There is no sort of like structure in the bust area. So you can either go with your strapless bra or you can wear a brassy bra and huh? put that in the eye buff for those of you who don't know. But the, it just didn't fit. Like the material is pretty, it's actually on the thin side. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little on the thin side. But it is, it's super cute. It just doesn't fit me. Like it's very tight. You can see how I'm kind of like really snug in it in the try on portion. Um, and I don't really hate like everything else about it. I like the length. I wish it had pockets, but eh, I won't be too mad that it doesn't have pockets, but it just doesn't fit me like I would have wanted it to. It's very, very pretty. I definitely thought I had plans for this thing here, but mm, it was like, yeah, no, we're not gonna fit you, sis. So bloop. Now the second item is a dress, which I am so bummed did not work out. Like, I mean, it works out, but like it doesn't. I have it in the 3X. I don't remember if a 4X was available because if the 4X was available, I would have gotten, I should have gotten that size because it fits me, but it's still like, if I breathe too hard, it's going the side, the zipper's gonna bust and we don't got time for none of that. So here it is. It gives me like really sexy Corella DeVille vibes. <laughs> But I I love kind of like this nice play on polka dots. So it's not like, you know, the symmetrical polka dots. But I love, I always love kind of like this pattern here. And I love this sort of cowl neck neckline. I love the spaghetti straps here. They do have to cross in the back in order for it to close. And I think that's kind of what drew me to it. I love kind of dresses like this where your back is kind of out. It's kind of accentuated. You all know at this point that my back is my favorite part of my body that I love to show off well, next to my legs and the decolletage. But still. I'm I'm in I'm here for it. This has a side zipper closure, which I didn't know that was there until I actually went to film because when I tried it on the first time, I didn't know there was a zipper there. And I was like, this is really hard to get on. Oh my gosh. But when I did try it on for the actual try-on portion of this video, I realized that there is a zipper here. And I will say zipping it up was easy. Trying to zip it up wasn't hard at all. But just having the dress on, it was very snug. It has uh, lining underneath here so it's not completely see-through but I just felt like it was just it was too much going on I felt like if I eat if I had one too many wings we were not gonna make it home just we just not gonna make it home in one piece and I couldn't have that it's super cute but um we're gonna have to pass moving on to the first dress that I have in this video and it's a polka dot dress but you know it was something about this green that kind of spoke to me it's not really like a mint green per se um it looks much more washed out on camera than it is in person, but I thought this was super cute. Very much Shayna off the shoulder. It gives me very like pixie, you know, Little House on the Prairie vibe. Sometimes I like that. I like that kind of like whimsical vibe that comes with these dresses, dresses like these because I don't really dress like that on a regular basis. So it's nice to be able to do that. The buttons are not functional at all. They're just there for show. And then it has elastic here around the waist. And I'm in the string here, again, just for show that it doesn't, it doesn't cinch anything. It doesn't do anything. I do honestly wish that it had more of a cinching situation going on because it kind of felt a little big to me and it has a high it is high low I honestly wish that it was just the same the same length I, that's what I would have preferred I mean that's just me but overall it's still super super cute it'll pair perfectly with the little square bag I showed you guys in the beginning of this video like all of it is just like super ugh. I just saw I had it in my brain I was like oh when I shoot this dress I'm gonna pair with this low bag when I do that so Moving on to this shirt that I have here. Now I'm gonna be 1000% like this is the type of shirt I've been looking for for like a long time. And I have not been able to find one that fit me the way I needed it to fit. And so I had to get one. I'm doing it no justice by holding it up, but when you see it on, you're gonna see what I'm talking about. Any, I've been dying for a, a shirt you could just tie in the front 
been dying for a shirt like this for forever and have not been able to find one that was roomy enough that fit me well so when I saw it online I was like I have to have it it's super basic obviously it's a white shirt it has super long strappy thingies here to tie your little your little knot in the front and then the sleeves have these cute little ruffle details here I don't know if the you can see it's kind of washed out on camera but it's really a simple white shirt that you can wear for the summertime you can wear it over your bathing suit you see I paired it with some jeans that's a look I've been trying to do for the longest and now that I can I'm very excited about it and you could pair it with the big round bag that I showed you guys in the beginning of this video so again we got options here and it's so I mean literally the shirt is the best you could wear it tied in the front like how I have it or you could flip it around and have the, the tie in the back so again a lot of options with this it's super cute and if y'all are like me and want to try these kind of like retro almost like 90s looks uh -huh. she ain't got y'all covered mm -hmm. you know summertime comes around i always wanted to be like how can i show more skin but be cute and then Shein gives you a matching snake skin set and somewhere in my heart i'm like y'all know me y'all understand me and that's what she just be thank you <laughs> Did I, were we here at the dramatics? Okay, great. <laughs> so, uh, yes, I have a matching short snake skin set. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Y'all, come on now. Y'all know me well enough to know I'm gonna get caught up in some foolishness when it comes to snake skin. Okay, so it has a top and it comes with the matching shorts. I have this in a 4X because of the shorts. When it comes to Shein bottoms, I always size up. I don't care what, what it is, I'm sizing up because of the fit. So I'll get into the shorts in just a minute, but the top is so adorable. So it looks like this, this actually sits in the middle of the bus line here. Actually, when I got it home, I was like, am I doing this correctly? I definitely put it on backwards the first time I opened the package. <laughs> I was kind of like, oh, this is this is incorrect. Okay, let me fix it. But this goes in the front. You put your arms through and you have to tie it in the back. The back has two ties here. You have a skinny strap. This goes across the back of your shoulder blades. And then you have a thicker strap, which this will go along the bottom, like, you know, towards the small of your back. And that is what's going to be keeping the shirt together. Your back is going to be out, which again, y'all know I love. And then you would have to just adjust yourself here in the the bust area. I would not advise wearing a regular bra with this because it's gonna be visible and that takes away from the actual look in and of itself, but you can always wear, what? A brassy bra. And the sleeves uh, are a little bit on the flutter side, not a super pronounced flutter, but a flutter nonetheless. So that way it's a little bit airy, a little bit breezy. You can always wear the shirt separately of the shorts. And this is why matching sets are awesome because you don't feel like you have to wear them together. Now, uh, the shorts are shorts. There's not much to them. There's not a lot of stretch, which is why I'm so glad that I sized up to the 3X. It has a nice uh, stretchy waistband. I wish it was a little bit wider. I would have preferred that, but that's just that's just me. But I mean, either way, it, I liked how they fit me. They came up a little bit high and yes, they are a bit on the cheeky side, but it gets hot in the summertime. I don't know about y'all. If you ever been to New York in the summertime, it is hot, it's muggy. And the last thing you want is to be covered in clothing. So you know, just a little, a little cheek, never hurt. Eenty body, I'm just saying. <laughs> but I love these two pieces together. As you can see, I look so dang on good. I felt good. And yeah, these are just really, 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 really cute, uh, really cute set. And I paired them with these sandals I found from Amazon. I think you all have asked me about these sandals before. I will look for the link if I can, and I'll put it in the description box down below as well. My last two pieces are my absolute favorites in this haul. You guys know I always save my favorites for last. Um, so I'm gonna start with this maxi dress that I have that I feel like, <laughs> I mean, I'm just a little cute or whatever. <laughs> And so here it is. It is a halter dress. Now, I'm not gonna lie. I had the biggest blondie moment, like the biggest blondie. And you know what? I'm probably still having a blonde moment. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I need you to bear with me because I really just now 
am having the biggest blondie moment of my life. It's a halter dress, okay? So, um, <laughs> I hope I did this right. So when I first got it, I didn't know, I forgot that it was a halter dress. So I was looking, I was like, what is this extra piece here? I was so confused. And then I was like, there has to be a hole. So then I finally found the hole and it, so I can stick this, what I thought was the belt, right? So it is, says it's supposed to be a maxi dress on me. Obviously it's much shorter for those of you who are new to my channel. I am six feet tall. So maxi dresses are not always going to be very long on me, but I don't hate because it fits me so well. I could, I could forego the length. For those of you who are short and or regular, you know, average height, this is going to be a maxi dress on you and you're going to look fire. But this is uh, the, the pattern and the color palette is absolutely 1000% me. I love that it has a little split moment going on here. It fits really, really well. I, it just, it, it overall just makes me feel like I am just a whole ass diva and I'm here for it. Now, my blondie moment literally just happened just now because as I was trying this on, right, I found this extra stringy thing and I was like, is that the belt? Huh. That's interesting. And I was like, the belt, it's a little bit short. I wonder why this belt is short. And as I'm literally sitting here talking to you, I'm like, wait a minute, that's the short one wasn't the belt. The short one <laughs> goes around my neck. <laughs> and then the long one <laughs> is the belt. Because I kept saying as I was doing this trial portion, I was like, why is this neck strap so long like what is <laughs> y'all I'm literally just now like wait a minute sometimes clothes need to come with instructions <laughs> so it comes with a belt that is removable and you have the neck strap that is removable but you kind of need the neck strap to keep the dress up okay okay get it together so you gotta finish this video but yeah, so um, just get the dress. It's super cute. I love it. Just remember, don't confuse the belt for the necktie. Just, yeah, don't do it. Don't be like me. <laughs> and the last piece is a romper because you all know Shayna loves rompers. Now this one, I did not size up it. I got my regular size and I love it. All I really need is just like get a pair of basic white kids. <laughs> we got a whole springy like summer look right <laughs> so here it is and again this also ties in the front so this is the back of the romper you have like the really nice wide elastic -y, stretchy thing to come around your back which makes it very very comfortable and then you tie these across your bubbies <laughs> it has spaghetti straps that are completely adjustable and the only thing I don't like that I really wish this had was I wish that the inside was not white. I Because when you tie the straps, you can kind of see the white. And I really wish that it was printed on both sides to eliminate that really weird like white thing going on. But, you know, that's just me. Um, it has really nice wide legs, which honestly, I thought this was a dress. Like when I saw it on the model, I was like, that's, that's a cute little dress. Might be a little short, but let's go with it. But it turns out it is a romper and it's super wide. You have a lot of leg room here which I love and rompers give you leg room because that way you don't feel like you kind of have to like completely readjust yourself all the time so I I mean I love this little thing I most certainly will get wear on this even if I don't have anywhere special to go it's so comfortable really lightweight and I feel like this would be great when like that sun heat is up and you want to show some skin but you don't want to be like too too raunchy and too ratchet like this is a good little mix and it's like it's so cute and it's so quaint and it's literally perfect so there you have it, you guys. That was my Shein haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed filming this video. I felt so cute in pretty much everything that I have in this haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what pieces were your favorite in the comment section down below. Thank you so much to the Shein team for sponsoring this video. It is always appreciated. You all know the deal. If there are any other brands or collections you would like me to try on here on my channel, please let me know in the comment section down below. I will go online and try to get that video up for you as soon as I possibly can. I wanna thank you 
you guys so much for sticking with me throughout all of the content I've been posting during quarantine. Thank you for your support. I hope these videos are helping you just to even break up your day. I hope that these are helpful to you to shop. You know, guys know this is my whole point in doing these videos. I wanna thank all of those who are still working through quarantine. If you have to go into the office or you have to go to your job, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you all are staying safe and staying healthy. And I'ma roll up out of here because it's time to go get some food and I'll see you guys in my next video. Deuces guys.